Are you like me and you think that adverts get in the way of a really good website? Well, I'm going to show you to get rid of those adverts today because they're freaking annoying. Is this thing on? Are we live? So here's a really good example of what I mean. Right, so I'm searching for a transparent background of an Amazon Fire Stick. That's it there. And I go into this website and uh, this is what I get. I get download, download. There's a download. It could be that one. Uh, there's uh, another, ooh, there's, oh, oh, there's, there's a lot, there's a lot going on there. So I'm going to get rid of all the adverts so I know exactly which ones I need to download. So here it is without the adverts and it's literally as just one button. It was that free download button. So if I click on that, you'll find that it downloads at the bottom. So that is a good example. Of adverts get in the way of a really good website. Again, here's another example. So let's say I wanted this image here. And again, we've got download here. We've also got free download here and you know it just gets a bit confusing so let's take away the adverts again and we'll find that that actually was a red herring up here and this is again downloading down the bottom here it also it also works for youtube as well don't use it in mine i need the adverts i need the ad revenue but it does actually work so here is my uh was this my latest video yes i think it is so if i just reload this it should come up with an advert so I'm going to get rid of those adverts now, and now I'm going to reload the page. And we'll find that it just goes straight into it. There's no adverts at all, and it works really well on YouTube. I was really surprised it works on YouTube because this is extension on Chrome. First thing I have to do is go up to the very top here. It's the little three lines again. Click on that, then we get down to more tools. And then we go to extensions. And then what we have to do is click on the little three lines here in extensions, click on that. And then we go down to open Chrome web store. And then we just click on add blocker plus, or no, we type in add blocker plus. Hit enter, it's this one here, adblockplus.org. You click on that. And I've already got it installed, but all you would do is, you know, install it. And then if it's not up here, what you do is you click on this little, um, what do you call that? I would say it's a little jigsaw piece. And if it doesn't have a wee pin on it, you just uh, click the pin. And you see, you just noticed it's just disappeared there because it's this one here, A, B, P. It has actually got settings as well. See if you click on this little icon at the top here and then click on the little settings icon. Uh, you can actually whitelist certain websites, which basically means if there's a website that you don't want, you want the adverts to show, then you just put in, well, there's a few that I've visited already. You've got general here, which you can actually help with uh, part of your privacy, actually. Uh, you can block additional tracking, block cookie warnings, definitely. I hate cookie warnings, do my head in. You've also got an advanced section as well. But generally, I would say, other than the block cookie warnings, I would say it just allow acceptable ads. It seems kind of the middle ground because well, a lot of people, it's their livelihood when it comes to adverts on websites. I know I'm kind of being hypocritical here, but anyway, I'm giving you the information. You can do what you like with it. We're all adults at the end of the day and we can all make our own decisions. It's not 100% though. This is an example here of a web page that will not allow it. So if I reload that, it comes up with, please take away your ad blo blocker, blah, 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 we don't like it. But it's not completely successful because all you would really have to do is click on, I am not a robot. Um, and then it actually starts to automatically download. So it's not the greatest, but you know, some websites don't allow it and they try and block it. Don't take any off anyone.